Okay, yeah, it's been a while. A, uh, between work and <clears throat> I put my back out, I was basically confined to bed for t like two weeks, something like that. So I haven't had time to do anything. Or and of course now I'm playing catch up, but still have a week back, so I have to be careful. But I decided it was time to replace these um, skis for the uh, snow thrower over there. Uh, as you can tell, they're <laughs> we'll, we'll pass their prime, right? Um, so, but of course nobody makes them, right? So, um, what I wound up doing was buying these and modifying them. Uh, got these from a guy who makes them. Um, I'll put the link down below. It's all he does is make skis for snow throwers, but mainly for, you know, newer, more popular ones. So this one, for example, um, I got both of them for $40 and it's for, gosh, I want to say an errands or something. Uh, but the, the, uh, the bolts that fit in here are, um, too wide to fit in these last two spots so I had to narrow them down uh, and grind away some of the stuff um, wasn't much maybe an eighth of an inch sixteenth of an inch on each side barely noticeable but um, very heavy duty um, they're powder coated uh, they feel like I mean they like they weigh a ton uh, but you'll notice they have a weird design so it's thinner on one end than on the other and that's because um, it depends on what you want to do with it. So uh, if for areas uh, where you have a lot of cracks in the sidewalk or in the driveway and where you're going over a lot of stones, you use the thinner end. And if you're going, if you have basically just um, a flat driveway or you're going to be going in grass, uh, you use the fatter end. The fatter end just gives it more of a float over everything, whereas the thinner end... Uh, is supposedly picks up on the cracks and you know just make, makes it go up on the curb easier or whatever I don't know so we'll see how it works um, I did like I said I modified it I got the one on already so uh, that's all set this is I set the height and everything's good to go there I just got to do that side now um, but for 40 bucks I was very impressed at how heavy duty they are and how well they're, you know. Um, this one looks a little dull in spots, but that's only because I had to repaint where I ground the metal off. But uh, when I got them, they were very shiny, very heavy. Uh, I just like them. I mean, I mean, so this one right here, that's how thick this was when I got it, or, you know, when it was new. Right? And you can kind of, whoops, I could get the camera in the right spot. So you can see the difference between the thickness, right? So, maybe over here. I don't know. You get the idea. So, that's what I'm going to be doing tonight. And then I'll be all set uh, in case we get any more snow, which we haven't. But um, So, a few lessons learned. Uh, there's no stop on the snow thrower. So when I lift it up... The back of the chute hits right here and chips the paint. So I'm gonna, um, I'll touch that up again. It was only rattle can anyway. And then um, I'll just have to be careful about um, when I raise the snow thrower up that it doesn't go all the way back. It doesn't need to. I just, a couple times I it's got too far with it. That's all. Uh, but then I think we're good to go. Okay, they're on. Uh, it's all set for the next round of snow, which we haven't had since the first of the year. Well, it's been icy, it's been raining, but no snow. And what, oh, we've had a dusting here and there, and not even worth cleaning up, really. But if it does snow again, it'll be ready. Uh, it's been sitting here for a while, taking up the garage, because that garage door decided to die on me. The, the opener there. Uh, it's about 20 years old, so I suppose it's 
probably all it was good for. So next weekend I'm going to have to swap that out, which should be interesting. The thing is, is uh, I've called around to several different shops, uh, places that will come and replace your garage door opener. Not one of them has called me back, so I'm, I'm done now. I'm going to do it myself, which should be a joke. I've never done one before, so anyway, that'll be that'll about that'll about do it for this one anyway. So hope everyone's having a good time. I'm I'm getting back to uh, moving around again. So talk to you all later.